I think the biggest problems that fintech companies approach us with are twofold. They're either really far along in the process and they're realizing they're behind or somehow not fulfilling their project timeline and they need help. And this doesn't mean that they need more people. This might just mean, what do we need to cut? What do we need to change? How do we need to modify the approach so that we can either deliver on time or rework the entire proposition so that it's more relevant for the end consumer? And the other one is much more technical because we've integrated with so many different providers in the past. And we can come in and actually speak directly about the problems as opposed to having a week of workshops just trying to understand how card payments work, which often happens when you hire a software agency or a company that's trying to help you with the actual core engineering. The engineers might not be familiar with the particular tech and the words like KYC, know your customer, or AML, anti-money laundering. Those are terms that most engineers might not be familiar with unless they've worked in the space. So having those terms and understanding them, I think, is key to us being able to help very quickly. But again, there's, there's many different scenarios. It could be a problem with uh, a myriad of different things, but I think it's really all either about help us get out of a mess, all the spaghetti code we created and we need to clean it up. Or it's about, okay, so we need to get going. Do you know the people who understand this stuff as opposed to us needing to teach it to them for weeks or months? I always like to say that Vacuum Labs is a guide for our customers. We're not just there to put in people and sit around while they do something that the clients tell us to do. I think we like to come in and as opposed to you know telling you where to go, We'll ask you questions, we'll try to clarify, we'll try to clean up some of the mystery 